Chris and I love a store called Wizard of Bras. In fact, we love it so much, how could we not do this? We are going to take you there. Take a look. We're at our favorite store, the Wizard of Bras in Monrovia, to get a crash course on the history of bras. Ooh. Let's go. Oh, good morning. We are here to meet the wizard. The wizard of bras. Yes. Hi there. I'm a wizard. Hi! I'm Monica. Nice, nice to, to meet you, you, Monica. Now, Wizard of Bras, you've been here for a while, right? 43 years. Wow. That's a lot of tatas. <laughs> it's a lot. a lot of tatas. So I opened a bra store. My mom started the store. Customers came in, she had clothing, and customers kept coming in saying, I can't find a bra that fits. So we started with one line and then another. And then we became the Wizard of Bras. Now, can you show us some? Show us the bra. Absolutely. Yay. The Wonderland that is. <laughs> is there a perfect Boob. Is it like a, the unicorn that women are looking for? Everybody thinks they're perfect. Everybody is asymmetrical. Everybody has one side bigger than the other. So there's no such thing as perfect unless it's done surgically. Look at all of these. If you go down this hallway, mm -hmm. there are 16,500 bras. Wow. wow. All in bins. And they're sorted by size and color and type. What's oh, the this? biggest size? Uh, 58J, I think, is the biggest band size. The biggest cup is a O. Oh, can oh. I? I need to see that. Okay, I need to see. You know sit. what? I will oh never my feel God. bad oh. about my bra size ever. Wow. You know what? That, that is bigger than me. That is. You call it bounty. <laughs> That's a bounty. That is a bounty. Oh, well, we yeah. say it's that old song, you know, Lord lift us up where we belong. <laughs> yes. Yes. This is the fitting room. Ooh. And you get to meet the original wizard. This is Bonnie. Hi, Bonnie. Uh, I thank you very much for coming to visit us. You are responsible for all of this. <laughs> Bonnie hooked me up earlier today, everybody. I mean, you, you look the best thing you said. Was, and now you're like modern art. Yes. Bonnie is the original wizard. All right. Bonnie, you told me the best thing. Never pull up your straps, right? Always support from underneath. That is correct. Just like a teeter-totter, one side goes up, the other side goes down. So if the back goes up, you're now pointing to the floor. Ooh. That's not optimal. You need to make a trip. I don't care where you are, if you're in Alaska, if you are all the way in Maine, you need make me to make a trip and come here and see Bonnie and That's get right. your situation <laughs> right. <laughs> you're right. Aww. Oh, oh, the wizards. <sighs> the wizard. And the guy's called a warlock. Yes, he is. A broad. Yes, he is. But here's the thing. You know, the wizard saved my life in the jungles That's of right. Costa Rica. This is a true story. We made a very bad career decision at one point. <laughs> yes, we went on a show that took place in the in, in the a jungle. rainforest in the jungle. And we don't camp. We don't. We're not very good at it. We're not outdoorsy people. I, I don't know if you could tell it by our physicalness. I really thought when they said like outside, they meant like you know like a breakfast. What do you call it? Like those places, people's bed and breakfast. Yes. Because to me, that's camping. Right, 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 right. So what happened was uh, we had to go through the jungle a lot, and apparently there really is quicksand in the jungle, and it's really quick, and it's quick. <laughs> So, was, so I kept quick. falling down into holes of quicksand and getting sucked down. And people would have to have to pull me up by my bra straps. <laughs> Which we got at the wizard. At the wizard. Because we went there before we were on the show. Like, we yes. need something that can support the ladies. <laughs> not whether we're, we get rained on, mud on us, whatever. And let me tell you something. You, that thing was like a steel girder. Oh, like, yes. you just weren't going anywhere. I wasn't going anywhere. And people, people literally had to pull me up by my bra. And it never broke. And never broke. It never broke. Thank you, Bonnie. Me Time with Frangela. 